hi, I'm uh, Margo or Riverless on Twitch. And um, basically, I've been wanting to play this game, use your outside voice, voice, Richie Tozier, for a long time because it's basically like a fix it, um, a fix it game of the end of it chapter two. And I don't really expect a lot of people to watch because it's kind of like a, a niche game from itch.io by uh, M-A-P-U-R, a M-A-P-U-R-L-S-Y-R-U-P. Um, and it's just like a fix-it sort of game. And I've been wanting to play it for a while, so I won't mince words or anything. Uh, I might do some voices, just like a... <laughs> disclaimer i might do some voices might get weird i don't know but uh here we go say la vie start game okay interesting oh okay this is cute major tom the ground to ground control? How do you, do you copy? Oh, wait, do I have to press buttons? Oh, space bar. Okay, there we go. I'm stepping through the door and something is terribly wrong! Oh my god, it's horrifying! Setting blasters to kill! Richie, I said no monsters! Major Tom, I'm facing some sort of alien life form. It's huge, and it's got tentacles, and way too many teeth, and it's covered in blood. Richie, don't be gross. <laughs> pew pew! It got Stan, and it got Eddie, but by Jove, it's not gonna get me didn't get me, I'm right here. I'll avenge them if it's the last thing I do! Eddie, get out of the way! Ooh, dang, that was loud. Let me turn this down. Just a twitch. Richard Wentworth Tozier. What have I said about playing inside the house? Use your indoor voice, please. Okay. Uh, sorry, Mom. Sorry, Miss Tozier. Promise we'll be quieter. Richie, get back here! I'm not fucking goddamn dead! Sorry, Miss Tozier. We'll try to be quieter. It won't happen again. you, Stanley, dear. You are always the most responsible of Richie's friends. Thank you, Miss Tozier. You'll keep an eye on him, won't you? Keep my Richard out of trouble. I'll... I'll do my best, Miss Tozier. Oh god, is this... This game is a fix-it, so it can't be, like, sad, but I might cry. The clown movie still has me in its clutches. And uh, keep in mind, I know nothing of this game. Just I just know it's supposed to be some sort of fix-it game. I know nothing at all. Oh. Oh no. No. Oh, the bad music. Okay. Richie said it the best. When we were here last. When, when we were here last? When was that again? Let's kill this fucking clown. Let's kill this fucking clown. I, am I supposed to 
supposed to be moving around? Oh god, oh, I don't want to move around. I'm not gonna lie, Richie, I'm really scared right now. I don't know if I can do this. But, you know. I'm really glad you're here right now. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna cry. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Okay. Ooh, that movie hurted me. What if I just leave? Bye. I'm I'm running away. Oh, guess I can't. Figures. What if I run the other way? I'm running the other way. Why do I feel like I'm about to be jump scared? I know I'm not about to be jump scared, but like, unless this music is so spooky. Okay, thank you, thank you, Eddie. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Oh god, I'm gonna cry a lot. Okay. Ooh, creepy door noise. It doesn't really help that I'm playing this like near midnight. Oh, it's the same, same, same voice, sorry, same line. through the walls. Really, Ed's mold is what you're worried about in this murder house. Owned by a clown that wants to eat us? I can tell you're laughing at me, Richie. Knock it off. Don't you fucking patronize me. I'll have you know that black mold is incredibly dangerous and can have long-lasting negative health effects if you are real if you are exposed to it over time. No. Of course I'm not planning on spending any more time than I have to in this fucking awful house. I'm getting the hell out of here as soon as that- as soon as fucking possible. Alright, bud. Okay, buddy. Ooh! Oh, it's so spooky. Ooh! This couch is covered in a thick layer of dust, grime, and cobwebs. It is stained with a mysterious fluid. You're talking about murder. Thanks. Thanks, bud. Thanks, Richie. Despite everything, it's still you. God, that hurt. Because that- because the movie! He was like, that's me! That's me in those flyers! That's my clothes! That's my name! Those are my glasses! Ugh, it hurts. It hurts to think about. Thank you for saving my life earlier, Richie. No problem. I mean, what's a little murder between friends, you know? I really mean it. And sorry for dragging all of you back into this. Yeah, Mike, you really just said, um, damn. So I guess we're really doing this, huh? This place brings back so many bad memories. But if not us, who else? It's the right thing to do. still so loud. Let me just turn down this a smidge. Okay, here we go. In bed. Scared? Anybody would be scared in this situation, Richie. Of course I'm scared. But mostly, I'm angry, I think. What that clown took from us? The lives we could have led if we hadn't forgotten? people we were meant to be. Yeah, I think I know what you mean. I bet you do, Buffaroonie. Can I just open doors? No, I don't- like, I don't want to open doors. Oh, wait. What about upstairs? I didn't check upstairs, but like, broski over here is just going. Uh, oh. Door's gonna close, ain't it? Door's gonna- what? What are you doing, bud? Where are you, where are you going? 
We just have to find that stairwell down into the basement. And it's like you said, we'll kill that fucking clown. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Blah, 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 blah. Oh no. Okay. That can't be good. I'd still be alive if it wasn't for you meddling ki- If it wasn't for you, Bill. I- What's- What's happening to me? Yucko. <laughs> He could have fucking died, man. You know that, right? You want Richie to be dead, too? I don't know. I, I don't... Please don't be mad, Bill. I was just scared. Th that's wh what he wants, right? Don't... Don't give it to him. I... <laughs> Bill- no wait, sorry, I'm thinking in terms of like Bill Hader, but Richie almost like literally got his- his whole entire guts rearranged, but like not in the fun way. And Eddie was just like, ah, I was scared. I was spooky. Richie, I am so sorry. Bill's right, you could have died. All because I couldn't get my shit together. Hey, don't worry about it, man, I'm fine. You're fine, it's- it's all gonna be fine. Just focus on keeping yourself alive, okay? Why did I say that? What a weird thing to say. Huh. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. So now we get insight to his thoughts too, huh? Cool. Funky fresh. I love it. Cash money. A lot of memories there. All bad. Back into the belly of the beast. Unless what's his fuck with the knife comes back. Wait, no, he died. I can't remember. Oh, we're here. We have to find the cistern. There should be a path further down from there. Gross, 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 gross! And we're walking. Ooh, what's this? Oh, I... I just want to get all the secrets. <laughs> That's what I do in these games. I just want to find all the secrets. Looks like there's no secrets to find here, but like I'm still... It's very nice visually. They did really well with like the... What's it called? The color palette. No, oh, here we go. Can I go further down this way? Or is it forever? Oh, no. There's a wall. Okay. Excuse me, Eddie. It's so... It's so messed up that they're making Eddie follow Richie in the game. Like, it hurts. Like, that kind of hurt Amido. Okay, here we go. I won't try to find any more secrets. I'll just go where the game leads me. But yeah. This is... This is making me relive the night I went to the theaters to see It Chapter 2. Bill Hader up on screen. And then all that freaking mess. Ugh. Um, you good? Bev? Bevy. Bev, what is it? Sorry. I thought I heard some. What, what the hell was that? Bev! And they go looking for her. Guys? 
Guys, come on, please. I don't want to walk out of here alone. And you won't walk out of here, I mean. Oh, she's back. Okay. That was an ominous message. I didn't think about it a lot. Mike? Where do we go from here? In the depths is where it crept. In the beneath to find belief. Alright. See you down there. billion dead bodies. S stay together. Oh. Sorry about the gray water ruining your shoes, but come on, man. It's kind of on you for wearing $400 cowboy boots into a sewer. Cowboy boots? Yeah? What's the deal with those, anyways? Yeehaw, partner? <laughs> Richie, what are you talking about? I'm not wearing and have never worn cowboy boots. And so you aren't. That's so weird. I could have sworn. Wow. Bill and Mike really just went in for it, didn't they? They sure did. I can't believe there's another, even worse, layer of bullshit. Underneath the sewer. Underneath the creepy haunted abandoned house. Figures. What do you have to say, Edward? I can't do it. You saw what happened earlier. If you let me go down there with you, I'm gonna get us all killed. Hey, hey. Listen to me. Who killed a psychotic clown before he was 14? Me. You're braver than you think. <sighs> Pardon me while I take a 20 minute cry break. Ooh. I'm gonna, ooh, I'm gonna cry a lot. I'm gonna cry quite a, quite a bit. Okay. Anyways, here. Take it. It kills monsters. Does it? Yeah, if you believe it does. Oh, I can't move. Oh, well, we're down there. You guys good? Made it through safely? It should be over here. This way. Here we go. Spooky, spooky, spooky. <laughs> Look at them all side shuffling. Uh. Ooh. Ooh, we're in it. Okay, and this is the part where they kind of lost me in the movie, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I don't like they were like mystical magical la 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 I don't know what really happened though it can only be attacked in its true form the ritual will show us that what is its true form <laughs> I hope it's something cute like a pomeranian I'll shut up it's light be snuffed out by darkness. Oh, this is very beautiful. Now, it's time to bring out your artifacts. The past must burn with the present. The boat I built with G G G Georgie. inhaler. Something that I wish I had held on to.
something that I did hold on to. A token from the Capitol Theater. Look closely. Do you remember this? The rock fight! Yes, the days these bonds were forged. Oh, and this shower cap. Can't forget about Stan. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Was that really the best you could come up with? Okay, everybody. Hold hands. The ritual of Chud. <laughs> it's a battle of wills. The first step was our reunion. The second step was the gathering of tokens. This is the final step. Ooh! Sans battle music comes on. Oh no, it's even worse. It's like a heartbeat. Turn light into dark. Everybody, repeat after me. Turn light into dark. 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 Oh. Nothing happened. Oh, that's right. Nothing did happen. Did, did we do it? Is that it? Did we win? We did it, right? Oogus. Oogus boogus. <laughs> You lied to us? Again? No. But they just didn't believe enough. That's why it didn't work. Are you fucking kidding me? I just... I needed something for us to believe. For me to believe. For 27 years I dreamt of you. I craved Oh, I've missed you. Time to float. Gotta go fast, gotta go fast. Oh, ooh, uh, 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 I hate that, I hate that. Oh, I hate that so much. Oh, I hate it so much. Can he see us? Shit, I think he can. Let's keep moving, Richie. Well, can I run? Looks like I can't. They said, let's get the hell out of Dodge, huh? Oh, the doors. Shit, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Which door should we choose, Richie? He's not fucking with us. Let's go with the not scary at all. falling for this shit again. Oh yeah, that thing's a fucking monster. Richie, make it sit. I know your moves, you little bitch. Richie, the noises have stopped. I think it might be safe to come out now. Sit. He did it! Oh, that's cute. That's a good boy. That's actually super cute. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Good boy. <laughs> ah! Scream. Shit! I saw it coming and I fell for it anyways. Next time, let's just go for regular scary, okay? Next time? 
Ooh. Oh. Foreshadowing is so fun. Shit! Shit! I think it has Mike! Hey, fuckface! You wanna play truth or dare? The truth is, you're a sloppy bitch! yippee ki motherfu- Wake up! I think I got him! I think I killed it! I did it! I think I killed it for real! So I'm gonna cry again, huh? So I'm gonna cry. Okay, don't cry. Okay. Eddie! Probably enough of that. Y'all know how this story ends, after all. No sense in dragging out the inevitable. Richie Tozier, ladies and gentlemen, take a bow, why don't you? Sorry, come again? You aren't happy with that? You wanted something different? You thought this time around something would change? Oh, you're disappointed. <laughs> Okay, okay, I hear you, and I get it. If you're satisfied with the events as is, you can stop here. If you want something a little bit different, well, I'll see what I can do. Why don't you play again? Look at that little Undertale stuff going on. What's the word? Font. That's what I was thinking of. Oh, wow. Captain Britain would absolutely beat Captain America in a fight. He's got magic. It's no contest. What can Captain America do? Punch really good. Eddie, I keep telling you I can't keep getting enamored every time they add a new hero to the roster. Captain America is an established character. There's no way they'd let him lose. Besides, which side won during the Revolutionary War? That's right, the Americans. Checkmate. Read a history book once in a while, why don't you? Old words from someone currently flunking US history. It's not that I don't understand the material, you know. It's just that sometimes it's so hard to pay attention to something so boring. I'm very easily distracted. What's Captain Britain gonna do? Fight Captain America with the power of... Standing politely in a queue? Attack him with the sheer might of... All the ma all the magics of a stiff upper lip? Utterly annihilate Captain America with... What does that even say? Something tea and crumpets? <laughs> made him laugh. Good. All you ever wanted to do was make him laugh. Oh my god, that hurts. So, uh, what you reading there anyway, Eds? It looks heavy and therefore boring. It's a book on common first aid techniques, just in case something goes wrong, you know? <laughs> Nerd. Go fuck yourself. Oh no, I can't hear you because I'm already falling asleep from just being in pr 
proximity to such a boring book. Literally? Go fuck yourself. I'll never be able to get through a book just like that. You're gonna have to tell me about. Oh. Imputation. Uh, probably stab wounds, right? Right? Stab wounds. Stab wounds? What do I do if I've been stabbed, Eds? Okay, well, for stab wounds... Pay attention, okay? This stuff is important. You'll thank me later. You might be able to save a life one day with this knowledge. For stab wounds, it really depends on where you've been stabbed. Chest wounds are extremely dire because of how many organs there are around there. But something like a limb? You can actually survive for a pretty long time with some field treatment. Whatever you do, try to keep the object they've been stabbed with in place, if at all possible. It sounds unintuitive, but that object is actually acting as a seal and holding all your blood and guts in place. If it's removed, all that comes spilling right on out. And then apply a tourniquet to the top of the limb if that's where you've been stabbed. Got it, Captain, my Captain. Oh, but if you did happen to remove the object, whatever you do, don't try to put it back into the stab wound. You're not resealing the wound, you're just stabbing them, stabbing the person a second time. That's bad. Oh, so no reinsertion. Like last night with your mom when... Beep beep, Richie. Okay then, so what about... How do you apply a tourniquet? Inquiring minds would like to know. Okay, so to construct a proper tourniquet, you it's always best to have a proper medical one on you. It's safer. But in a pinch, all you really need is a strip of fabric and a windlass. I did I probably did not pronounce that right. A windlass? Yeah, you tie the fabric and wind oh wind last. And wind the wine last through, twisting it to make sure the tourniquet is tight enough. So it's sort of like uh, turning a key in a keyhole, I guess. Well, I know how to wind up my last if you catch my drift. Oh my god! Shut up! Just shut up, Richie! <laughs> this is so. This is so peaceful here. <gasps> Man. Why are these pixels making me yearn? The fuck? What the heck? What the heck? Richie said it b best when we were here last. When we were here last? Just here? Let's kill this fucking clown. it was worth it. I'm sorry, that's unfair. I don't know where that came from. Yes, you do. Scared? Anybody would be scared in this situation, Richie. Of course 
first I'm scared, but mostly I'm angry, I think. What that clown took from us? The lives we could have led if we hadn't forgotten? You know? The people we were meant to be. Something's in the fridge. Stan. Stan's head is in the fridge. How did I know that? I'd still be alive if it wasn't for you, Bill. I... what? What's happening to me? I'm not... I, sh I, I can't even make that serious. Just because I... The head on the floor. It's just... Richie to be dead too? Bill, lay off him, okay? We're gonna be fine, so just leave Ed's alone, please. I was just scared. That's what what he wants, right? Don't don't give in to him. Oh, now what? Oh, guess we're all going into the basement. Listen, it's okay, bud. No sweat. Richie, I'm so sorry. Bill's right, you could have died. All because I couldn't get my shit together. Just, just focus on keeping yourself alive, okay? It's just, something feels like it's gonna go wrong, you know? <laughs> F. F in the chat for that one. That's, that's tough. A lot of memories there. All back. Back. Into the belly of the beast. Again. We have to find the cistern. There should be a path further down from there. Gross, 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 gross! You know what? We've been through this already. This feels a little redundant. Let's just skip ahead a little bit, shall we? 
I feel like the narrator here is just kind of sassy. Not sassy, but like, kind of like, let's, let's get a move on, you know? Bevy! Bev? What is it? Sorry. I thought I heard some. That is, I don't like it. Bev! Guys? Guys, come on, please. I don't want to walk out of here alone. Well, we already know that you won't walk out of here. Oh! Oh, I just realized what that- Oh. Oh, God. Oh, man. Mike? Where do we go from here? In the depths is where it crept. In the beneath to find belief. Alright. See you down there. Stay together. Did you say that last time? I'm not sure. Still dead set on doing this then. Of course, nobody other than we can after all. We have to so nobody else gets hurt. Abandon my friends. Ooh, weird. Still dead set on doing this then? What do you think? I'm so scared right now, Richie. I don't want to go down there. If you let me go down there with you, I'm gonna get us all killed. Then don't. Let's just leave. Forget about that stupid clown. Let somebody else deal with it. That is a canon Richie response, to be honest. I, I can't! I'm so scared right now, but I just... I can't! Something isn't letting me. Here. Take it. It kills monsters. Does it? It doesn't. Yeah, if you believe it does. That's still ouchy. That is ouchy. That hurts. Let's just get to the next important part, shall we? And a quick word of advice, just between friends. In the future, don't try to mess with my design. What do you, what do you mean mess with your design? I didn't try to mess with your design? Of course I, I would never. It can only be attacked in its true form. The ritual will show us that. What is its truest form? It's not a Pomeranian, I'll tell you that. Oh, shut up. It's light. A light that must be snuffed out by darkness. Again, I really enjoy this lighting scene. This is just very pretty. Now, it's time to bring out your artifacts. The past must burn with the present. The boat I built with G G G Georgie. My inhaler. Something that I wish I had held on to. did hold on to. A token from the Capitol Theater because I... It doesn't matter. Look closely. Do you remember this? The rock fight! Yes. The day these bonds were forged. Oh! And this... Shower cap. Can't forget about Stan. Well, 
Regardless, it's still nice to be appreciated. So genuinely, thank you. Okay, everybody hold hands. The Ritual of Chud. It's a battle of wills. The first step was our reunion. The second step was the gathering of tokens. This is the final step. to us? Again? No, but they just didn't believe in us. That's why it didn't work. I just, I needed something for us to believe. For me to believe. For 27 years, I dreamed of you. I craved you. I've missed you. Time to float. Can he see us? Shit, I think he can. Let's keep moving, Richie. Why? Let's just go this way. Or not. Because we're blocked in. Don't worry about it, it's fine. Too scary next time? Shit, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Which door should we choose, Richie? Doesn't matter. All three of them are gonna be terrible. Why would Pennywise ever give us a good choice? You try to open the door marked scary, but to your surprise, it refuses to open. Pennywise would take any opportunity to fuck with us. This door is locked firmly shut. It seems you aren't getting in without a key. A key? What about very scary? He's gotta be fucking with us. They're flipped. I'm going with very scary. Are you sure? Positive. Trust me. Oh, this one's the girl, isn't it? Ooh, this one's... No. It's another me. You told me to trust you! A key. Maybe it's a not very scary? He's not fucking with us. Let's go with not scary at all. Oh, shit. No way am I falling for this shit again. Oh yeah, that thing's a fucking monster. Richie, make it sit. I know your moves, you little bitch. Richie, the noises have stopped. I think it might be safe to come out now. Sit. He did it. Oh, that's cute. That's a good boy. That's actually super cute. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Good boy! Scream! Shit! 
I saw it coming and I fell for it anyways! Again! Next time, let's just go for regular scary, okay? Next time. But isn't this already? I tried going for scary. Yeah, I can't go to scary. Weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A key. Where do I find a key in this back ass backwards game? Shit! Shit! I think it has Mike! I what if I go help him? Then Eddie will skip. Oh. Oh, I don't even get a choice, do I? Just skip. Rich, wake up! I think I got him! I think I killed it! Eddie! I did it! Eddie, you have to move! I think I killed it for real! No. No, not again. Eddie! with that. Fundamentally, nothing changed. I don't know what you're talking about. For example, some parts were less uh, green. And you got more. Isn't that what you wanted? Oh, come on now. Did you seriously expect... What do you want next? The keys to the kingdom? Sorry, but I can't help with that. We are playing again. Absolutely. Hello. Oh, this is new. What's this? Oh. Hi, hi ghost. How you doing? Sorry, I'm just doing a playthrough. Uh, you don't necessarily need to have seen the movies or read the books. But, you know, just context. It's just a little fix-it game for, like, the end, so it's kind of spoilery. Just a little warning for you. But yeah, I won't be checking my chat much. But if you want to stay, go for it. Hello? What do you want? Ask him about... Ooh, what do I ask him about? Ooh, keys! We need keys! Sort of a, a key. You want the keys to the kingdom? Well, you can't have them. Those aren't for sale. Again, I already told you those keys aren't for sale. It's certainly not for you. They're mine, and I'm not just going to go around handing them out willy-nilly. Ask again. I already told you those keys aren't for sale. It's certainly not for you. They're mine. I'm not just going to hand them out willy-nilly. Well, I'm not the weirdo who repeats my lines, am I? Watch to Arthur. Fine. You asked for it, bucko. Careful, careful, careful. The 
once it featured King of Camelot? Is that what he's doing? Is, it, is this a Merlin reference? Anyways, you successfully taken the keys. Do with them what you will. Okay, I will. Thank you. Thank you, old Merlin. Richie said it best when we were here last. I swear, we just... Why does this feel so horribly familiar? Let's kill this fucking clown. Baby, power is real. Thanks. Anyways, I just shit my pants. <laughs> that I that was scary spooky. Eddie, where are you? He was right behind me the whole time. He should be here. I knew that was gonna come back into play. Oh, I knew it. Ed, Eddie. He should be here. He's supposed to be. He's supposed to be dead. Eddie's dead, isn't he? Place the key from earlier into the keyhole of the scary door. Fits perfectly. No, oh, I'm going in. Okay. What's happening? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, nice music. Oh, this reminds me of the, uh... I know I've like made like several Undertale references, but I've never actually played it. I've only watched playthroughs. And this reminds me of that one that you have to do to get to Temi's place with all the glowing mushrooms and stuff. It's nice. Oh, what's all the- Oh, is this- Oh, tell me this is Stan. It's almost complete. Only one piece is missing. Stan! 
long time no see. I'm going through the books right now, but all I see is red. Did I make the right choice? Because in the end, it is an immutable, immutable, immutable fact Eddie died. Was it because I wasn't there? And the losers weren't whole? Was I the missing puzzle piece? How, I mean, how could it be his fault? I don't really blame him. I, I never blame Stan. It was just sad. How could it possibly be your fault, Stan? Why did I do it? Best way to protect them? It's not your fault. Maybe so. But does it matter what I intended if the final outcome was bad? It matters, Stan. Thank you. You want to save Eddie, right? Even though he dies every time? Even if it seems impossible? Yes, so much that it hurts to breathe. And why is that? Uh. <laughs> oh, this hurts. This hurts a lot. This makes me. This makes my heart go ouch. actually said it. Richie Tozier, ladies and gentlemen. Currently playing the role of Orpheus. Orpheus, desperately trying to pull his beloved out of the underworld. Except we all know that story can only end in tragedy. He just couldn't stop himself from looking behind. Well, you should be able to save Eddie, if you want. You have the key, after all. I'm glad it got to you safely. But to do so... Idea to look back. All the stories say so. Look what happened to Lot's wife. Look what happened to Orpheus. But Richie, to get a happy ending, I think you actually need to look back into the past. You need to figure out what went wrong. You need to figure out why this keeps happening. Richie, you haven't got all day, but also you have all the time in the world. You should go save Eddie. But if you would like to sit here and keep me company just for a little long while, just for a little bit longer, well, that would be fine by me. Of course, I come with. Yeah, come with me. Come with me. I don't know if I can come with you. I mean, I think I might be able to, but the question is. Should I? Well, let me try to explain it. Okay, Richie. Do you know how sourdough bread works? Yes, I picked up bread baking some years ago, and yes, I am aware it's yet another hobby for old people. Focus, Richie. So, with sourdough, you have a culture of yeast called a starter, otherwise known as the mother dough. It's the base from which all other bread is made, and must constantly be kept alive. Some mother doughs are hundreds of years old. When you want to bake bread, you take a piece of the mother dough and create an offshoot. This is called a levain, or levain. You can also use the levain as a new starter. For example, if your friend wants to start baking, but they're all going to trace back to that original mother dough. But here's the thing. The reason San Francisco is famous for its sourdough is because the specific microorganisms that exist in San Francisco create a particularly tasty bread. If you take a levain, or a levain outside of San Francisco to New York or Florida or Maine, eventually it's going to take on the microorganisms of this new environment. And it's going to taste different. If you stray too far, really feel like San Francisco sourdough anymore. But, you know, it's bread. All bread is going to be pretty good bread. So, what 
what you're going to have to do is, basically, you need to go back to the beginning to find that mother dough and create a levain. And the parts that you can't stand to live with, you switch out. But the other parts, even the bad parts, I think they have to stay, mostly. Otherwise, it'll feel cheap. It'll feel unearned. So there's always something you'll want to come back to. Plus, someone has to be here manning the control panel, so to speak. But even after hearing all that, what do you want to happen? Come with me. Come with me. No, this is a fix it. I'm fixing it all the way. All the way. Bad shit happened. Okay. I'll see what I can do. I'm ready, Stan. Be who you want to be. Be proud. And if you find someone worth holding on to, never ever let them go. Good luck. I love you. And this is very important, Richie. Don't forget to use your outside voice. You'll understand when you get there. Yes, Richie, I know you love me too. Tell everyone I said hello, okay? And tell Patty... Tell Patty I'm sorry. Stan, I love you. You should get going. Remember, you have to go back to the start. Stan. I love you, man. I love you so much. <laughs> oh my. That was... That was a lot. That was a lot, and that was really sweet. I mean, it was sad, but it was really sweet, I think. Back to the start. Is there another way to go? Can I keep going? Hmm. I thought maybe back to the start been like further down the road. Not the bridge. Not the bridge. Oh man, this is gonna hurt me a lot. This is gonna really... Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. It's... It's not what it looks like! Hey, calm down. I'm not gonna hurt you. Please! You can't tell anyone about this! And there he goes. up the pen knife. This brings back memories. You know you told Eddie to be brave, but have you followed your own advice? But here's the proof that once you were brave, once you were young and reckless and stupid, once your feelings were so strong that you threw all caution to the wind, because the urge to leave some sort of evidence of their existence time felt far greater than the risk of being found out. Yeah, finish the carving. There we go. <sighs> okay, pull it together. This part is important, but Richie, I think you have to go even farther back to figure out why this keeps happening. You have to go to the very beginning. Birth? Where am I? What is this? Who is this? Where? What is this? Hi. Sorry. Who are you? Where are we? Okay. Spooky guy. Hi. Sorry. Who are you? Where are we? Richie Tozier's my name, and doing voices is my game. That can't be right! I'm! Yes, yes, you're Richie Tozier too. We all are. 
Can you guys help me? I'm trying to find a way to save Eddie. Oh, man. I saw the 1990 movie. That, that, that hurt. I watched that in seventh grade. That was scarring. Sorry, but who is Eddie? Oh, it's starting to come back to me. Sorry if I don't concentrate well enough, I start to forget. Me too. Eddie's dead, and there's nothing you can do about it. There's no point in trying. God, Ed, he was so sweet, you know? Wouldn't hurt a fly. Are you... Are we talking about the same guy? I think he was trying to protect me from the deadlights. Yeah, that sounds right. He tried to protect me, and got his arm bitten off for the trouble. No? He got impaled by one of its claws, right through the chest, and I had to leave him behind. We couldn't carry him all the way back up, so I had to leave him in the cistern. God, Eds would have hated it down there in the dark, in the grime. But that's not right. We brought him out. How could we not? In a world where friendship was more important than anything, how could we leave Eddie behind? And then... And then I forgot. I left Derry for the last time, and I forgot about the rest of the losers, including Eddie. But that's not right either! We left him behind, but I don't think I ever forgot him. None of the losers did. And we didn't forget each other, either. In our increasingly connected world. How could any of us simply forget each other? I was in love with Eddie, you know? You were... You were what? I was in love with Eddie! I'm guessing neither of you two were? I... I wasn't... I, I don't know. I... Are you sure? Definitely! Surer than breathing! I guess it's possible. I could have been in love with him. But it was a different time. You didn't say this sort of thing out loud. So then it sounds like things can be different for all of us. Little details here and there. And big things, too. So why aren't we allowed this one big thing? Where we are is a museum of sorts. A mausoleum. Sure. Or a waiting room. I guess if you... If you want, you can wait here with us. A oh, hell no. Maybe in... How long was it? Maybe in another 27 years we'll get another Richie. And maybe the difference for this one will be that Eddie is allowed to live. We'll have to wait and see. Won't know till he gets here. I'm not waiting. I wonder what would happen if I chose that, though. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, I'm going. I'm leaving y'all losers. So you're heading out? I'm not gonna stick around. No, I'm done waiting. I'm gonna fix it myself. Richie. I was thinking about our conversation. About how I was the only one out of all of us who was able to carry Eddie out of the sewers. There must have been a reason, right? I want you to have this. This was Eddie's tie. I pulled his body out of the Deadlands, so I got to keep his tie. If nothing else. Maybe you can use it somehow. Other Eddie's tie. It's the most cheerfully patterned object you've seen. That's right! Oh god, what a garish looking object. Good luck. Richie, you should know. If you decide to leave here, you can never come back. You'll be forging your own branch from here on out. I think that makes you the lucky one out of all of us. Richie Tozier, getting off a good one. Here, 
This is probably what you came here for. So go forth, sally onwards, ho! Out of the blue and into the black. Save Eddie. Or perhaps, out of the black and into the blue? there together rich rich hey rich wake up i think i got him i think i killed it richie you know what to do i did it you should have everything you need you got this i think i killed it for real in fact I'll even tell you the first step. Ready? Then let's rock and roll.
okay, okay. I see. That makes sense. Thank you for letting us know. I just spoke with the nurse. They said that he's out of surgery and conscious. But as for his arm... They, yeah, they were... I want to say they were able to save it. It's going to be... A, it's going to take a long time to fully heal. And there's some nerve damage. But they were able to save it. The nurse says we can go see him now. If we would like. Richie, whenever you're ready. Sorry, Richie's got to go vomit into a vomit bag real quick. Can I talk to her? Probably not, right? Richie's got to go just cry, cry a lot, really quickly. Wait, what about Stan? Where's Stan? I want to see Stan. Come back, Stan. Where are you, bud? My guy. Oh, is that, is that Stan? What happens next? Well, that's up to you to decide, isn't it? Aww. Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. That was so good. That was so good. I've been waiting so long to play this game. Because I just have not been emotionally ready for it. I've been waiting so long to play this game. That was so good. The music was good. The visuals were good. That was really... Ugh. Who, thank you. Thank you to who made this. This was so incredible. This, ma this made... I wish I could have played this directly after I watched the movie. Then I could cry for like three days instead of just the two. Out of sadness and then out of happiness. But yeah. I Thank you. Thank you. So good. Um, if you haven't played this game before and you really just want to fix it, uh, I definitely, like, even, even if you've just watched this, you know, even if you've just watched this video, I really strongly suggest, like, going in and playing the game because, like, even in my head, I, like, I was saying the voices out loud, but in my head I was hearing their voices, you know, I was just like, oh, yeah, yeah, this is what they would say, this is what they would say, but yeah, credits, here are all the credits, there's two people, just, wow. Incredible. Oh, I guess I could have played on a bigger screen, but okay. <laughs> Whatever. But yeah, thank you to anyone who um watched and uh stuck around. Many thanks um to the creators of the game. Again, this was incredible. But yeah, I think I will take my leave now. Au revoir.